Today's Tuesday tax tip has to do with nutritional supplements. Very often during tax season, I am asked whether um, a taxpayer is allowed to deduct vitamins and supplements, um, sometimes a special diet uh, type food that they would take. And generally, the answer is going to be no. There are a couple of exceptions. If you are on something, let's say you're on a gluten-free diet because a doctor is, having, is treating celiac disease, which is a disease that um, has a problem with gluten, uh, that you would be able to deduct the cost of your gluten-free diet. However, you would only be able to deduct the excess of the costs over the gluten-free diet over a regular diet. So in other words, if for some reason you were paying you know, $7 for an item and then the gluten-free equivalent of the same item was $9, you'd only be able to deduct the, the $2 difference. Um, as far as vitamins and supplements, generally they are not deductible. Again, unless a doctor has uh, specifically told you to take these in order to fight a diagnosed medical condition, not just that it would benefit your general health. Um, then other than that, as far as drugs themselves, pretty much only drugs that are um, prescription are allowed. Uh, the one exception that I know of is insulin, which I do not believe is... is um, is, is needed you need a prescription for but it is still allowed as a deduction so I hope this helps you out and I will see you again next Tuesday